unboxing is the one and only Ruby by Katherine Applegate, um, the companion book, or maybe sequel, to the one and only Ivan. Um, really popular book. We all loved it. Um, and so this story is about Ruby, and it picks up a few months after the events of the one and only Bob. Wait, one and only Bob? I missed that one. So I guess there's the one and only Ivan, and then the sequel, the one and only Bob, which I totally missed. And now the one and only Ruby. Okay, so something happened in the one and only Bob, and now this is a few months later. Now living in a wildlife sanctuary, Ruby's caretaker from the elephant orphanage in Africa is visiting. Seeing him again brings back memories of her life before the circus, and she recounts the time she spent in the African savanna to Ivan and Bob. I don't know who Bob is. Could he be that kind of like dingo dog? This highly anticipated novel and verse is the perfect mix of heartfelt and humorous, poignant and sweet. Artist Patricia Castellau returns to the world of Ivan and his friends with gorgeous black and white interior illustrations to complete the story. Don't miss the film adaptation of the one and only Ivan now streaming on Disney+. Plus. Oh, also fantastic news. So, is this is a novel in verse? Oh, I didn't realize. I, um, the one and only Ivan I thought was not a novel in verse. I thought that was more of a, just a novel. Oh, so here you get a sense of the illustrations. Very cinematic. Um, So let's read the first page. And here's elephant body language. Watch out. I'm scared. Let's play. We're pals. I'm worried. I'm silly. Okay, here's an elephant glossary. My big little problem. Nobody ever listens to the littlest elephant. And around here, the littlest elephant is me. Brave. When you're the littlest elephant, even if you very helpfully say, hey, I better jump in the pond to see if any giant hungry snaggle toothed crocodiles might be hiding in there, one of the grown one of the grown-ups will say, I think you've had plenty of water play today. And then if you splish splash the muddy water with your trunk, just to be extra sure. There aren't actually any big giant snaggle tooth crocodiles hiding in there because you are that amazingly brave. Not that anyone appreciates you. Another grown up will loop her trunk around your tummy and pull you away from the water's edge and say, Come on, silly tusky. That's a real for instance. Okay. Um, the one and only Ruby looks fantastic. Um, I think even if you miss the second one like I did, I think it's still perfectly fine, standalone. Um, this is from Harper, um, an imprint of HarperCollins. Um, thank you to Harper for sending this to me, and thank you for watching.